Hello, Murph here for an Omnicube Pro overview of the Stealth Seamer. This unique seam setter not only levels and joins your materials, it can actually flatten warped or bowed stone. It has large 8 inch cups and 3 ceiling rings to provide a strong and reliable hold. And 4 leveling points per unit provide optimum seam control. There are two versions available, a manual and an automatic. The manual stealth is sold individually and is suctioned down with these thumb pumps. They have easy to read indicators to let you know when it's time to re-pump. The automatic model comes as a pair with a compact vacuum pump that's powerful enough to overcome challenging porous materials. The great thing about the Stealth Seamer is that it helps you deliver consistent results and it's not complicated to use so you don't have to rely on that one guy who does great seams. What if he's out for the day? With this anyone can set beautiful seams every time. I've got some automatics here and I'd like to show you how they work. I've already done some basic leveling with shims because you do need to get the pieces reasonably close and level before you apply the seamers. Set on the stealths, one at the front and one at the back. Make sure all the leveling feet are up and connect the stealths together and then to the pump. Turn on the pump and listen for that change in tone. Do you hear it? That means they're sucked down securely and you're ready to dry fit the seam without adhesives. Bring the pieces together but not all the way. Leave a slight gap so you don't have any chipping the stone while you're making adjustments. Now, bring down the leveling feet until they just touch the material. We'll use these to level the seam and actually you can even bend a bowed piece, which is nearly every time, right? We have all these leveling points to apply pressure right where it's needed. Start at the front, pushing down the high sides, then the back, and then the middle. Remember, we're just dry fitting this. There's no adhesive in there yet, so adjust it as much as needed. Once you've got it all dialed in, you can reopen the seam and add your adhesive. When you close it, be sure to leave that little gap for a final check. It's possible something may have moved and this is your last chance to make it perfect. Okay, I'm happy with this. Let's close it tight. And look, I've still got all this room to come in and clean the seam. Easily, thoroughly and right now. This eliminates all the extra scraping and scratching after the glue has cured, which is a huge time saver. Now while the adhesive is curing, you're free to go and do other things. Once it is cured, just pop these off and you're done. It's that simple. Oh, and a bonus feature. You can actually use this for holding backsplash, to press and hold the piece onto the wall for it as it sets. To do this, disconnect the hose from this cup and plug it in over here. This will isolate the vacuum to just this one cup, leaving the other side free to move. You can't do this with anything else. Just be aware of what your material can handle, don't be cracking it. Ultimately, it doesn't matter how big or fancy your shop and equipment are, if the job gets messed up during the last 20 minutes of the install, that crooked seam is all the customer will ever see. So equip your crew for success with the Stealth Seamers to provide you peace of mind and your customers with stellar, consistently beautiful seams. For more information visit Omnicube.com, give us a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive future pro overviews. Okay, till next time, cheerio!